in this video <coughs> we are looking at uh, tracing option available within SAP so this transaction is ST05 <coughs> you can trace the SQL trace buffer NQ trace that means printing RFC trace HTTPS APC and AMC traces so these are all the traces available you activate the trace by clicking on activate button here so you get a message saying that you activated But if you want to activate only certain user, right? So turn off, deactivate trace now, and then activate with filter. Okay. Let's say you want to activate SAP star. Okay. Only that uh, ID. Okay. <clears throat> so you can also look at you know include uh, tables. Let's say USR zero two. exclude table so you want to just see uh, and then you want to trace su01 you can also trace that so this will be useful for uh, all the z transactions right or any z transaction you are trying to execute you want to see what is happening or rfc calls being made within the trans right so that's the one you want to trace okay <clears throat> then um, so display trace you can just click on display trace here it will show you the trace which is captured So in this case, we may not have anything because we never did anything. So let's see. <coughs> so this is a very good uh, tool for you to analyze exactly where the which tables are being pulled up and which tables are being activated. Okay. So here we are saying, see here Mandant. <laughs> this is basically instance name, B name. Select where am I managing from? You see here US or BF2. So select statement, this one from this is. <clears throat> so this gives you the exact select statement. Thanks for watching the video. Please click on the link below to download the cybersecurity tool, SAP cybersecurity tool. Thank you.